Picture this. States once flourishing, now teetering on the brink of collapse. America is facing unprecedented challenges, and some states are struggling to hold it together. From economic downturns to social unrest, these states are on the edge. Understanding these collapsing states is crucial, whether you're planning to move or just stay informed. But before we unravel the 10 fastest collapsing states, make sure to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell icon so you never miss an update. And let's see if we can get 5,000 likes on this video. With each passing day, the situation becomes more urgent. Let's dive into the details and see which states are crumbling under pressure. Number 10. Illinois. Illinois faces a staggering public pension crisis with unfunded liabilities nearing $140 billion. The state's population has been declining for years, with residents fleeing high taxes and corruption. The Chicago crime rate exacerbates fears, making Illinois a state in peril. According to the Illinois Policy Institute, over 860,000 people have left the state since 2010. Experts warn that without significant reforms, the state could face financial ruin. The job market is also shrinking, with major corporations relocating. Educational institutions are struggling with budget cuts, impacting the quality of education. With soaring property taxes, many homeowners are finding it hard to make ends meet. The state's debt burden continues to grow, making recovery seem almost impossible. Number 9. New Jersey. New Jersey's financial woes are no secret, with one of the highest tax burdens in the nation. The state's pension system is severely underfunded, creating long-term financial instability. Recent studies show a significant outmigration of residents seeking more affordable living conditions. The high cost of living and housing market collapse add to the state's troubles. The economic disparity between North and South Jersey is stark with South Jersey particularly suffering. According to the Tax Foundation, New Jersey ranks dead last in its business tax climate index. The state's infrastructure is also in dire need of repairs, further straining the budget. Public services are being cut, affecting the quality of life for many residents. Political gridlock makes it difficult to pass necessary reforms. New Jersey's future looks bleak without significant changes. Number 8. Connecticut. Once a thriving hub for finance and industry, Connecticut now grapples with a faltering economy. The state's budget deficit has ballooned, leading to cuts in essential services. Residents face some of the highest taxes in the country, prompting many to leave. According to a report by the Yankee Institute, Connecticut lost over 40,000 residents between 2018 and 2020. The state's job market is stagnant, with few opportunities for young professionals. Businesses are also fleeing, seeking better conditions elsewhere. The housing market remains depressed, with high foreclosure rates. Educational institutions are underfunded, impacting future generations. The state's debt levels are unsustainable, threatening future fiscal health. Without drastic measures, Connecticut's decline seems inevitable. Number 7. Louisiana Louisiana's economic challenges are compounded by natural disasters and political corruption. The state's poverty rate is one of the highest in the country, affecting millions. Hurricane damage has left infrastructure in ruins, with insufficient funds for repairs. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, Louisiana has the third highest poverty rate in the nation. The oil and gas industry, a major economic driver, faces decline. The state's education system ranks among the worst in the country, with high dropout rates. Crime rates in cities like New Orleans remain alarmingly high. Public health crises, including high rates of obesity and diabetes, strain healthcare systems. Political corruption scandals further erode public trust. Louisiana's path to recovery is fraught with obstacles. Number 6. West Virginia West Virginia is in a downward spiral, with a declining population and struggling economy. 
The coal industry, once the state's backbone, has collapsed, leaving many jobless. According to the West Virginia Center on Budget and Policy, the state's workforce participation rate is the lowest in the nation. The opioid crisis has hit hard, with addiction rates soaring. Educational attainment is low, with few opportunities for higher education. The state's healthcare system is overwhelmed, unable to meet residents' needs. Infrastructure is crumbling, with many rural areas lacking basic services. The state's budget shortfall has led to cuts in essential programs. Environmental degradation from mining activities poses long-term risks. West Virginia faces a bleak future without significant intervention. Number 5. Mississippi Mississippi consistently ranks at the bottom in terms of health, education, and income. The state's poverty rate is the highest in the nation, affecting over 20% of residents. Educational outcomes are poor, with low graduation rates and underfunded schools. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, Mississippi has the lowest median household income in the country. Healthcare access is limited, with many areas lacking adequate facilities. The state's economy is heavily dependent on agriculture, which faces decline. Infrastructure is outdated, with many roads and bridges in disrepair. The job market offers few opportunities, leading to high unemployment rates. Political challenges hinder effective governance and reform. Mississippi's future remains uncertain without significant changes. Number 4. Alaska Alaska faces unique challenges with a struggling economy and harsh living conditions. The state's oil revenues, once a major source of income, have declined sharply. According to the Alaska Department of Labor, the state has lost thousands of jobs in recent years. The high cost of living and remote location make it difficult to attract new residents. Infrastructure is lacking, with many areas inaccessible by road. The healthcare system struggles to meet the needs of a dispersed population. Educational opportunities are limited, with many students leaving for better options. The state's budget deficit continues to grow, with no clear solution in sight. Environmental challenges, including climate change, pose additional risks. Alaska's future is uncertain, with many residents considering relocation. Number 3. New Mexico New Mexico's economic struggles are compounded by high crime rates and poor education outcomes. The state's poverty rate is among the highest in the nation, affecting quality of life. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, New Mexico has the second-highest poverty rate in the country. The job market is stagnant, with few opportunities for young professionals. Educational outcomes are poor, with low graduation rates and underfunded schools. The state's healthcare system is overwhelmed, unable to meet residents' needs. Crime rates in cities like Albuquerque remain alarmingly high. Public services are being cut, affecting the quality of life for many residents. Political challenges hinder effective governance and reform. New Mexico's future looks bleak without significant changes. Number 2. Kentucky Kentucky faces a myriad of challenges, from economic struggles to public health crises. The state's poverty rate is high, affecting over 16% of residents. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, Kentucky has one of the highest poverty rates in the nation. The opioid crisis has hit hard, with addiction rates soaring. The job market is stagnant, with few opportunities for young professionals. Educational outcomes are poor, with low graduation rates and underfunded schools. The state's healthcare system is overwhelmed, unable to meet residents' needs. Infrastructure is crumbling, with many roads and bridges in disrepair. Political challenges hinder effective governance and reform. Kentucky's future looks uncertain without significant intervention. Number 1. Puerto Rico, U.S. Territory Puerto Rico, although not a state, faces a dire situation that deserves mention. The territory's economy is in shambles, with a public debt exceeding $70 billion. According to the Federal Reserve Bank of New York, Puerto Rico's unemployment rate is more than double the U.S. average. 
The impact of Hurricane Maria is still felt, with many areas lacking basic services. The healthcare system is struggling, with hospitals underfunded and understaffed. Educational institutions are in disarray, with students lacking essential resources. The job market is stagnant, with few opportunities for young professionals. Public services are being cut, affecting the quality of life for many residents. Political corruption scandals further erode public trust. Puerto Rico's future remains uncertain without significant intervention. The United States is facing a range of challenges, with some states struggling more than others. From economic downturns to social unrest, these states are on the brink of collapse. It's crucial to stay informed and understand the risks involved. Remember to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell icon to stay updated on our latest content. And let's see if we can get 5,000 likes on this video. If you enjoyed this deep dive, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insightful content. And if you're curious about Top 10 States for Tech Jobs in United States 2024, check out the video on screen now. See you next time.